what's going on YouTube laugh if you want this is the easiest way to help me remember the concept of refractory absolute refractory and relative refractory period is by using this toilet bowl the back of this toilet pretty much is going to be the heart so right now at this time it's repolarized it's ready to go it's full now I'm going to flush it when this is completely empty we are fully depolarized okay the back here is fully depolarized your heart has nothing in it it's fully depolarized okay at this point when you get to the point of absolute refractory it absolutely does not have enough water to flush again your heart is not full enough absolutely not to flush again So when we let it fill up a little bit more, I'd say maybe halfway, a little less than halfway, you get into your relative refractory period. This is now going to be have relatively enough water to flush again. Your heart is going to have relatively enough blood to go again. So I'm gonna let it fill all the way up, but right now, if I go to flush it again it's gonna flush. That's gonna be relative refractory period. So when it was down low and it was absolute, it absolutely didn't have enough water to flush again. Now it has relatively enough water here for me to flush again. It's relative refractory. And once I let it fill all the way up to that water line, it's full. That means it's fully repolarized. It has rebuilt. It's got the uh, blood back in and water back in. It's ready to be flushed again. So pretty much when you're looking at your EKG, you have your P waves, you're going on to your QRS complex, that means your atrial, your atrias have uh, depolarized. As you're going on to your ventricles, you see your QRS complex, your atrias are now refilling, it's repolarizing, and your ventricles are now depolarizing. Once you get to your T wave, your ventricles are now repolarizing, it's filling back up. And that's pretty much my easy concept of refractory, absolute refractory, relative refractory period. Leave comments if this helped you out. Leave comments if you're still a little confused, but this helped me out.